Twitchy ladies, my name is Jack Septic Guy. Welcome to Resident Evil 2. I played the demo of this very, very recently, but now the full game is finally out. And I cannot wait because it's been a really long time since we had a really good horror game, and I've heard fantastic things about this. The reviews have all been really stellar, and I mean, just the demo that I played, just that 30 minute section already kind of blew me away. So I'm very, very excited about this. I think it's going to be phenomenal. Um, so I, I want I, I want to get spooked. I want to see what's going on. I've never I've I should reiterate this if you haven't seen me play the demo of it I've never played Resident Evil 1 2 or 3 the original games. I know blasphemy of the highest order But I've played Resident Evil 4 5 a little bit of 6 and I and 7 um, So I I haven't played Resident Evil 1 2 or 3 so I don't really know the ins and outs of all the story and all the characters and everything So I'll be experiencing this for continue I don't have a save. I didn't even start the game yet. Um, Leon S. Kennedy. I do know that you can play from Claire or Leon's perspective and you get two different versions of the game. So I'm going to start out with Leon, because that's the original scenario, and then Claire is B-side? Technically? Maybe? Leon S. Kennedy. The S stands for sexy. After a few days of radio silence from his new post, Leon S. Kennedy drives to Raccoon City to scope things out, unbeknownst to him. A nightmare awaits! Don't do it, Leon! Don't say it! Okay, let's do, uh, regular ass, plain, normal Jane mode, because that's what I am. Um, whoa! Oh, man, I'm serious, okay? I saw this with my own eyes. Oh, I believe you, buddy, I believe you. <laughs> Just tell us a story, tell us a story. Okay, well, it was last Friday night, I was walking home from the bar, and this woman started coming towards me. She was staggering- Holy and crap, that fucking rendering you know? is nuts! <laughs> Closer and I got a good look at her. You had to see her eyes, her nose, her whole face. It looked like it was rotting. Yeah. She looked like a corpse. Like a walking corpse, man. She was. Sounds like my wife. Ha! Like it. I, I got him. Sleep since that night. All right, calm down, buddy. Calm down. Just, hey, you gotta stay strong, okay? Don't give in to fear out there, right? Yeah, well, you got that right. If you freeze up around these things, it'll sink to teeth and little. Just getting good. <laughs> Jesus, the rendering of that burger and the facial animation was fucking bonkers. Oh, it looks so good. Uh oh, you're going to hit somebody, dude. Oh, no! Oh, God. Oh, absolutely wiped her out. Must be a truck driver's worst nightmare. Howdy, bitch! What do I do? What am I gonna do? Oh, God! You're gonna turn around, that's what you're gonna do! <laughs> Fuck yeah! Oh, is it Leon time? Is it Sexy Kennedy? Leon Skennedy time? There he is. Captain Jawline. No one's around. This is bad. That's weird. Hell yeah. <laughs> yes, we are open. Come on in and die. Oh, straight into gameplay. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Look how good this game looks. Jesus. God, I'm so excited for this. Now I'm not on a, on a fucking 30 minute demo, I can actually take my time. 
I want to search around and do everything. Because again, I haven't played Resident Evil 2, so I don't know all the ins and outs and the secrets and stuff, and what's added and what's new and what's old and... I'm excited to learn. Hello? It's me, Mr. Skennedy. Hello? Anybody there? Oh. Something's not right. Mm. You think? Broken down police car? Bloody footprints everywhere? They don't even have my favorite chocolate bars! Something definitely wrong. Also, I can hear somebody freaking out. You all right? Oh. Hey, bud! Don't move. I'll be back for you. Don't move, but also don't die. Ooh! I really need to get a six pack. Okay, remind me when I come back, dude. What's going on over here, though? I'm also really excited about the audio in this game because they use real time binaural audio. And as a sound geek, it's very impressive stuff. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna turn it up in my ear holes. Oh god, did you lock me in here? Oh, you son of a bitch! It's just you and me, sexy Kennedy. Caution, heavy door. I laugh in your face! Oh god. Oh god. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Ah! That's so fucked! Oh, your face looks like a leather bag! Oh, I have a gun! Freeze, motherfucker! Halt in the name of Sexy Kennedy! Okay. You had to do it to him, Leon. Oh god. My, my handgun's called Matilda. Me and Matilda are gonna go waltzing. Okay. Are you dead? Ooh, dead ass, though. Oh god, he's gonna get up again, isn't he? Oh, stay down, bitch. Stay down, bitch! It can be, Leon. It can and it is. Go ahead, go ahead, get off me! All right, press! Get off me, bitch! Okay, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I've seen one too many movies to know shit's all fucked. Oh god, he's a zombie now. Oh god! Uh, okay. Okay. Sorry. This is for locking me in! Sit down. Be humble. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh god, there's ambos everywhere! Clear! Don't shoot! Get down! No shoot! Okay. Is everybody all right? You all right? Yeah, I think so. Thanks. You can thank me later, when we're safe. Holy shit! Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Oh God! Come on! Run, Skennedy! Hold on. Turn on the siren. Blaze your way out of there. <laughs> Straight into Raccoon City. What the hell is going on? I don't know. Shit's fucked. They'll have some answers at the police station. Wait, you're a cop? Yeah, Leon Kennedy. You are? Claire. 
a red field. You live around here? No. I'm looking for my brother. He's a cop too. Oh, Chris! Well, it's a good thing we found each other. I don't know what to expect anymore. Love's hard to come by. Do you think love can bloom on a battlefield? Just like one of my Japanese animes? Ooh, yeah, buddy! Strong start. Ooh, I'm excited! Because there's something just about the gameplay in this that just feels so perfectly video gamey. And I don't know how to explain it. It's just so fun to play. And they did such a good job, and the visuals really sell it, though. Visuals really sell a horror game. Is that Hunk? Wanna play as Hunk? So many people from the Nihon! Oh, that's cool. President Evil. If I became president, that's what I want people to call me. All citizens. Due to the citywide outbreak, you were advised to take shelter at the Raccoon City Police Station. Free food and medical supplies will be provided to everyone in need. Oh my god, this is so unreal. Police station's not much farther. They'll know something. Yeah, but what if we're the only ones? What if there's no survivors? No, there's survivors. It's a big city. There has to be. One thing I appreciate about the Resident Evil games, it just drops you straight in. It doesn't spend like an hour setting things up. It was just like, oh, I'm here. I don't need to explain why. And you just start shooting fools. Looks like we're walking from here. Yeah, I'm good. More like running. <laughs> yeah, good call. Oh god. Leon, we gotta back up. Oh lordy. Oh hey! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Is that our burger friend? Holy shit. There, get out. Get out now! Oh Jesus! Hold on. Where are your seatbelts? Like a glove. I like his shoes. I want his Whoa. shoes! Oh, Claire's dead. Oh, no. oh lord! Yeah, it looks that way, doesn't it? Oh my god, this looks so fucking pretty. Okay, calm down, lady. You. Okay, bye. Peace out, bitches. I am Shit. not fucking with that. It's everybody. They're all drunk. Not everybody, Leon. You're not turned. You're not hashtag turned. Oh there yes. The station. Oh, the lighting is so good. I want to have sex with it. Give me. Ah, oh, I'm out of bullets. Okay, I'm 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 gonna go in here. If you guys don't have anything to say about it, pleased to make your acquaintance. Now lock that shit. 
Wait, but what about Claire? Haha! <laughs> Suck on that, Zambos! How does it feel to be locked in the other side of a cage? Actually, I'm the one that's kind of in a cage. The city's out there. Okay. Let me check around a little bit. I don't want to get my nice new white shoes wet and dirty. Okay, cool. Ah! Familiar territory! Okay, cool. Now this is where we were in the demo, so I know what Hello? to do and where to go. Is anybody here? Marvin? Where are you, man? Sweet. Okay, let's let's save before we do anything else. Oh, the music. Real proud dad. That's Leon. He's a real proud dad. There has to be someone here. Wait, wait for it. Wait for the line delivery. Not good. <laughs> I am the law. I gotta find that guy. Yep. Alrighty. I'm not in my sexy police uniform, though. I know how to use a map. Though, at some point in this playthrough, I'm gonna get severely lost, and you're gonna see me use the map a lot. Okay. Let's see if there's anything different from the demo now. I can't go through there. I need three items to go in there. One of them is in the statue up above. Whoa. Might need to change my sensitivity a small bit. Wow, look at the size of this giant green herb. That's going to heal like 10 people. Hello, Mr. Lion. See, if I was good at the game now and did the, the stuff in the demo really well, I'd be able to get into that already. But that would also break the game, and I don't want to do that. Look at this nice little outfit. Looks like you're ready to go to church. Abe? Alrighty. I guess I have to go under the shutter. Don't dead open inside one. Nothing else around here? I guess I should check this too. Check everything! Leave nothing! Everything is useful. God, I really hope that this game does well. Please, if you're watching a YouTube Let's Play of this and you even remotely think it's cool, please buy this game. Because it's such a good remake. Just the effort that went into it and the, the dedication to the craft and everything is, is already really cool. And I would love to see them remake Resident Evil 3 and then hopefully 4. I would love a Resi 4 remake. So basically, I'm being selfish and saying, hey, go buy this game so I can get what I want. Welcome to Raccoon City! Did you know? While we are the home of pharmaceutical giant Umbrella Corporation, dun dun dun, Raccoon City is a vibrant and dynamic city with a long, rich history of its own. In this guide, we'll introduce you to just a few of the more unusual points of interest our city has to offer. Have you seen the zombie-filled area? And also the zombie-filled area? Raccoon City Police Station. The building in the center of town wasn't always a police station. In fact, it used to be an art museum. Various features like the unusual clock tower and the goddess statue in the main hall remind us of a bygone era. The orphanage, just a few blocks from the police station, is an orphanage founded and run by the Umbrella Corporation with the help of generous donations from businesses and citizens alike. Now all the kids are zombies. It doesn't matter, they don't have parents. The building is known for its stained glass window, which attracts visitors from all around the world. Oh, I can't go through. I need the spade key. I really can't get over his shoes. They're so distracting. It looks like he's getting ready to head to the disco. Do you think he was going to, like, his girlfriend's house? And then this shit happened. He's like, well... I guess I'll have a few minutes to make a detour. Okay, I don't need to use the item box yet. 
Keep out! Don't open dead inside, real proud dad! <laughs> this would already be a sign to be like, yeah. Maybe you shouldn't be in here. <laughs> Coming to the police station, the last bastion for safety that they're all talking about, and then you come in and it's like, oh wait, no, shit's fucked as well. I need a fuse for that. Okay, it's much darker than what the demo was. Maybe I should up the brightness. We know who's behind there. Big heckin' Chonkasaurus. You got this. You got this, man, you got this. Personal pep talk. Let there be light. Okay. He dead. My fellow Americans. I love Leon Kennedy. The middle S in his name stands for sexy. And every time I see him, he looks just that. I don't know how he gets his hair to look so good. <laughs> That's a bad impression. <laughs> Alrighty. <coughs> oh, use those bulging biceps. I'm a strong boy. Cleaning in progress. Well, you're doing a fucking terrible job. <laughs> Is everything the same? Okay, cool. God. This is so atmospheric. <laughs> so good. I wish I did kind of play the original. I'm, well, I'm glad that I'm experiencing it for the first time with all of you, but I do kind of wish I. Cap! Hold on, I'm talking to my Open people. I kind of wish I was able to play the original first while I could have. I kind of wish I did so I could see how different it was, but. Oh well. I'll get you out! I get you out, but this time no blowjobs under the door! Okay. So far, so good. Dude, come on! What'd I tell you? <sighs> he's a fellow real proud dad, though. But he's only half the man he used to be. Oh god, it's so gross. <laughs> hmm. I guess I know where dinner is. Okay. Oh, you have the things. Oh. Was that like that in the demo? Can't remember, but stay back. I have a gun. Wait, I want to see if I can do this. Peekaboo! I want to see if I can get him to crawl over the desk. Yeah! <laughs> It's so awesome! Okay, I probably should just leave. I don't- I don't want to waste too much ammo fighting these dudes. Because I only have a limited supply. Okay, well he's down. For good, hopefully. <laughs> you fucking better be! <laughs> You look like someone took a pair of dentures and stuck dynamite in them. Okay, oh god, that's gross. Excuse me, excuse me, come through. I need the boards. You must have been very bored in this room. <laughs> I make jokes to suspend the horror. God damn it! Calm down, Leon. Okay, sit down, I don't trust you. Okay. I'll be back though. Eventually. Sometime. But first I gotta go meet my friend Marvin. Come on. 
Oh god. Hell yeah! Oh, Marvin don't give a fuck! You're safe. For now. Howdy, bitch. Thanks. Marvin Brown. Leon Kennedy. Leon Kennedy. There was another officer I, I couldn't... I couldn't... Here. Ew, it's all covered in blood, though. Ew. <clears throat> I'm sure you did what you could, Leon. My boy! That's my boy! Not a clue. Ah, oh, now I got my uniform. Honestly, all you need to know is that this place will eat you alive if you aren't careful. Yeah, well, I was supposed to start last week, and I got a call to stay away. I wish I'd come here sooner. You're here now, Leon. That's all that matters. Okay, Lieutenant. I'm ready. Hopefully you'll be able to find a way out of this station. That officer you met earlier, Elliot. He thought this secret passageway might do the trick. Mm. This is good news. We can get you to a hospital. No, no, I am not the priority here. Lieutenant, I'm not just gonna leave you here. I'm giving you an order, rookie. You save yourself first. I'd come with you, but I'd just slow you down. Now. You'll need this. I can't take it. Stop. <laughs> and don't make my mistake. If you see one of those things, uniform or not, you do not hesitate. Sir, yes, sir. You take it out. Or you run. Got it? Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Merv. Look at those sexy locks. Do you think he conditions? Combat knife! I can put you out of your misery, sir. <laughs> Got my knife. I'm ready. Um, okay, can I check my... How do I check the thing? Okay, officer's notebook. So... Which one is up here? So, lion, uh, weed, and bird. Is that this one? Oh, but I don't have room for it, do I? Ah, I'll get it after. That, that, that can be the last one I get, because I can come back down here anyway. I'll head through here first. We do the demo sections. And now I can take my time, and I know where the stuff is! I know where the shotgun is now, if it actually is still here. I'm ready. Oh, is control is map too. Nice. Mm. Oh wait, I don't need this key. I can put it in the item box, right? I should also save. Actually, no. Let's player's tip. <laughs> don't save over the same one all the time in case something happens to it. Yeah, a well-worn key. Cooley! All right, nice. Doing good, Skennedy. Just don't make my mistake. If you see one, uniform or not, you do not hesitate. Got it? So much atmosphere going on. It's dripping like the blood from the ceiling. Yeah. Excuse me, are you a fellow real proud dad? Oh, oh God! Oh, Jesus! He's fine! Huh? What? Oh. <laughs> Who even put you there? You ain't gonna get me this time! Oh, God. Somebody did open head surgery on that guy. Officer of the month, Marvin Brana. Oh, 
Oh, my bud! Marv! You didn't tell me you were officer of the month. Is this a liquor scratch? Uh, what what should I board up? I'm gonna board up this one because something comes out down here Hi That'll hold him <laughs> Good luck getting through wood bitch Okay calm down. Oh wait, there's an open window right here shit <laughs> Hello I'm new here can someone show me around? Preferably someone who's not fucking dead? Okay, now I can actually read these. September 25th. We're turning the station into a temporary shelter due to the massive sudden outbreak. All police personnel have been instructed to make the safety of the citizens their top priority as we try to accommodate as many of them as possible. Seven, to September 25th, addendum. One of the refugees attacked us in the middle of the night, resulting in the death of one officer and injuring three others. The person in question was quickly restrained. We believe this was simply a case of someone snapping under intense stress. The next day, a mob attacked the station today, resulting in a number of casualties. A few survivors were able to make it safely behind the emergency shutters, but surrounded as we are, it'd be hard for any of us to escape this place. We're not sure we can fix any of our comm equipment, so we remain cut off from the outside world. The next day, there was another clash on the west side of the station around 1pm. 12 people died and there's only a handful of survivors left. Everything is falling into disarray in here. David Ford. Well, David. Shit's fucked. Blim! Maparoo. Oh. This is locked this time. Doesn't a lady come out of that in the demo? Hmm. And away I go! Real proud dad. On his way. Oh, I've got so many boulets! To shoot or not to shoot? That Araquesto. I'ma shoot. I don't want you coming back and biting me in the ass, literally. But your head didn't explode, that means you're probably not fully dead. Stay down, sir. Oh god. Oh wait, I didn't get a, a key card this time. Sheet, it's changed, right? Can I get the 109? And the 106? Uh, one, zero, nine. Ta-da! One, oh, six. <gasps> Ta-da! I'm a fucking genius. All right, let's get these first. I don't think I can get the others yet. It's a roll of film. Open. Yeah, see, I got a key card last time in the demo. I guess they moved it. Uh, 208 or 203. Now, see, the two and three are missing. Oh, God. Motherfucker. So I can't get anything else yet. Okay, what what do you want? I'm busy! Okay! Boundaries are not a thing, apparently. What I tell you! Stay down! Oh, he dead for goodness and for realsies. Okay. I ain't gonna fuck with nothing, okay? I ain't gonna fuck with nothing until it fucks with me. Okay, I can't hold you. Uses a gunpowder. Gunpowder and high grade gunpowder, yellow, makes shotgun shells, and mag ammo is yellow times two. Okay. Alright. Stay down, stay down, stay down, stay down. I don't know the code for this. Oh, he's gonna get up. September 28th. It sounded just me and three others. No weapons, no ammo, and too many skirmishes have drained us mentally and physically. We're not gonna make it. Officer Phillips once suggested we escape through the sewers. Apparently, there's a secret tunnel under this place, left over from its museum days. Ah. 
I brushed off her idea before, but now it's not sounding all that bad. Yeah, there's no proof that there's even a tunnel, or that the sewers aren't infested with zombies, or that she's not a lying asshole. But I don't want to sit here and wait to die either. It's a long shot, but I'm going to try and find out what I can can about the tunnel. Elliot, that's the dude who got split in half under the doorway. Okay, I'm not going to go too far in here. Rookie's first assignment. Leon Skennedy, we're putting you on a very special case for your first assignment. Your mission is to... Unlock your desk. The key to your success is in the initials of our first names. LSK? Input the letters in order of our desks. There are two locks. One on each side of your desk. Make sure you get them both. Basically, your first task is to remember your fellow officers' names, but you figured that much out, right Leon? Good luck. By the way, it might take a little while to work out Scott to... to... A little work to get Scott to give you a straight answer. I need to be able to fucking... Speak. Brana. Scroll in a corner between drops of blood. Be glad you're not here, rookie. Okay. So... L... S... K? What? Is this Marvin Brana's one? I can't- I can't do Marvin- I can't- I can't do a B. There's no B. I thought Leon Skennedy was my name. I don't know, man. Oh, wait. Maybe it's this one? Nope. This might be Marvin... Brana. I don't know his middle name, though. Let's just try all of them. Okay, I don't know. I'm- I'm- I'm gonna come back to this. So I have to do that for all the discs? <laughs> oh, Jesus fucking Christ, man! Wait, is this still a spade door? Yeah. Welcome, Leon. Oh, that's sweet. Okay, wait. Maybe if I- maybe if I read my notes. Does it have a- a thing at the end for Elliot Edward? David Ford. I don't have the middle ones though. Your mission is to un to is to unlock your desk. The key to your success is in the initials of our first names. Input the letters in order of our desks. Oh, okay. There are two locks, one on each side. Okay, so I need to I need to learn way more dudes' names. So maybe M E D. Ah, okay, wait, hold on. Just lay down! So, N... E... Something. N... E... Let's just try all of them. Cool! Dope. Ah, Ned! David Ford! Okay, so... Then we have Leon... Wait, yeah, I should probably just check these. No. R... Shit. Ooh! L-R-M? Okay, so Brana should be there. I don't know. MRG. Okay. Got it. Hey! Oh yeah, because this is my desk. High capacity mag. Fuck yeah. Whoop whoop! Off to a flying start. That took me way longer than it should have. It wasn't that difficult, Sean. Use your freaking brain -o. Oh god. Sir, I'm gonna have to stop you right now, okay? I'm going this way. I'm going into my safe room. Nice. Okay, I can get rid of a, a, a film in here. Okay, let's save first. Boom! Medici medicinal benefits of herbs. Green herbs have the ability to heal basic injuries, while blue herbs have been used to treat poisoning. As for red herbs, while they are visually appealing, they offer no medicinal benefits. Or so it was thought until recently. It's well known that combining herbs together produces blends that heighten the herbs' effects, but it has been discovered that red herbs can play a big role when mixed properly. 
According to Strength and Wands Constitution. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Film contains evidence. Do not leave out. Okay, I can't pick you up yet. Let me let me do this first. Commemorative photo. Okay. What's the fucking point? I don't know. Put you here. And then let's combine. Boom! Now oh, I can snort that and be happy. Can't use it though. So I am going to put it in my box until I have a use for it. Now I have a bunch of room for everything else. Need to get a pouch. Need to get a little hip pouch so I can be a big boy. And save again just in case. You can never be too careful when you're saving. Wow. Okay, I'm going back this way. You can wow all you want. I don't care. Boom. Wait, can I combine these? No, that's not what I wanted to do. Loads of space. Okay. Stay down, will ye? Jesus, zombies, man. You just can't kill them for some reason. Ooh, boards. That'll work to shut this fucker up. What was that? Yes, I'm listening. Hey, don't you fall? <coughs> Come this way, sir. Fucking hell. <laughs> Wee. <laughs> Stay down. Oh god. Okay, I'm not wasting any more bullets on you. General Grievous. Hello there. Men's locker room. Do you think we're gonna get to see some butts? A portable safe? You can examine an item at different angles, okay. Oh. How do I- I have fucking no idea. Do I put it in? Oh. Oh, okay. So there's actually a a system to it. I don't know what fucking buttons I pressed. I'm making music. Okay, whatever. I'll figure you out later. Oh. <laughs> Press the button to light up its corresponding lamp. Light them all to open the safe. The buttons must be pressed in a certain order. Pressing a single button out of order will cause all the lights to go out and you will need to start the sequence over again. So basically, it's process of elimination. You know, the most fun. Can I have these boys? I don't have enough room, do I? No! Well, at least I know where they are. Um, wasn't this one like bio? Uh, no, because I can't do that now. I think people were saying it in the comments. Or one of them is like res and one of them is bio. <gasps> oh god, he still got me! Ugh. He's dabbing! Dabs are dead, dude! Just- well, so are you, and you came back to life, so... Maybe dab is a zombie move. Um... No, not yet. I'm, I'm just taking stock of where these things are. I can come back and get them later. Hopefully. Maybe. I don't have enough room for them right now. Maybe I should mix all my red and greens, though. Is this one bio? Nope, this one is bad! Ban. Bam! Bow. I don't know, I don't have any information on these. I don't know what they are. Ah! Oh, fuck. Wait, can I combine a green and a green? Oh, I can. Sweet. There we go. Sit down, lady. 
Oh, oh, oh! Ist das Liquor? A liquor boy! Go on by the window. It's taking me way longer to get through just this section of the game now because I'm actually able to take my time with it. It's very nice. To any survivors, consider this a gift for anyone still unfortunate to be alive. Keep your eyes peeled for those creepy fucks that look like they were skinned alive. Lickers, we call them. They're blind as bats, but their hearing more than makes up for that. <coughs> so long as you don't run around like a total idiot, like a fucking stupid moron bastard, guns a-blazing, you should be able to slip right by them. Probably. Either way, make like my grandma and creep around as slow as possible around him, yeah? Yeah. Anyway, not that I want to go, but duty calls. That, and I've got a friend to avenge. Uh, maybe BAB is a thing. But yeah, I think the liquors you can just walk by and they don't... They don't get triggered. Let's see if we can put in BAB. I don't know, is there anything that I've seen that might even be remotely a code? B. A. Nope. Maybe a different one. I think I can just explore at my heart's content after a while anyway, so we'll do that. Bordos! Oh, this fucking creepy ass thing, Jesus. What is even in there? Oh, it's a medallion for the thing. I need to get a detonator though. Ah, hip pouch. Some guy's scribblings. Damn those corporate assholes, they cut me off. After all I've done for them? But if that's how it's gonna be, so be it. I'm gonna have a little fun of my own as the world goes to shit. I boarded all those filthy pigs up in a steel pen and set some C4. All I gotta do is detonate it and sayonara, suckers! But it's no fun if it's over too soon, so maybe I'll give that one raving loon something to really squeal about. Yeah, maybe I'll give him a little toy and tell him, kill the guy next to you and I'll spare the others. I wonder what he'll do. You yell about justice and pride, but how many times did you go against me, your own superior? Yeah, you're such a good cop. So good you had to die. Man, is this fun! I need some music for this. Okay. Fucking crazy. So I need a detonator for the C4. Oh god, they both got killed. <laughs> oh no, there's a- Oh god, there's a whole bunch of them! Well, he did say he was gonna do that, so... I'm not gonna test him. God, so many bullets. That's good. These are good signs. Um, is there gunpowder here? Uh, the boards might be more useful to me right now. But, I have no idea. Alrighty. Marvin? What you up to, buddy? If only I could call in and see what you're doing. I miss the sound of his voice. I really wish if there was just one simple way. Leon, it's Marvin. Marvin! I need you back here ASAP. <laughs> Are you okay, Marvin? Got something to show you. It's important. Copy that. I'll be right there. It's not going to be your penis, is it? It's not, I don't want to see that, Marvin. Down I go. No, down I go, Leon. I said. Hi. What the? You're gonna go waltzing with Matilda right now. <laughs> These are by far the best zombies I've ever seen in a video game. They actually feel like zombies. They feel scary. They feel threatening. They feel exactly like you'd imagine a zombie to be. Well, uh, a pop culture zombie at least. As opposed to, you know, real zombies. Um, alright, what was my thing? Um, officer's notebook. What was in this? So the lady is... Lady, arrow, snake. Wait, that's not- that's a fucking horse. <laughs> the horse is Pisces, Cancer, Aquarius. Pisces... Cancer, Aquarius? <gasps> Ta-da! Oh, wait. Oh, I can fit it! What did I use up a second ago? Gunpowder. 
Shit. I really should figure out my, my little mobile safe thing. But I had, can head back to the main room and head back to my item box right now. Red book. What? Okay. Son of a bitch. I'm gonna put some bullets in you for a sec. There we go. Oh, I used bullets. That's what I did. Oh, okay. We we'll do this. We head back to Marvin. We'll get to my safe box, and then I'll come back up here. What's up, Marvy? What did you got to show me? Oh, is it that cat video? I might have seen it. Vine compilation? There you are. Come here. Take a look. Claire! Yes. I knew she'd make it. Oh, you know her? Yeah. Name's Claire. I came into town with her. You can get to that courtyard. <coughs> Second floor. East side. <laughs> I'm on it. Thanks, Lieutenant. Hmm. Marvin, are you gonna make it? Are you okay? Because right now it seems like you're all kinds of fucked. And I hate seeing my boy like this. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna stash- No. I'm gonna stash these things for now. And then I'm gonna go back and bulk up on all the shit that I missed. I missed a red book, apparently. Well, I could probably put the medallion in, right? Doesn't really make a whole lot of difference right now. Hi, fellas! I'm back! Did you miss me? It feels like you missed me. It feels like you might have been crisp pining for me. Oh, wait, can I go in here? You. No. Did I just try that already? Yeah. Oh! Okay! Yeah. Calm down, lady. Fuck. Okay. I'll be back here later. I need to get the C4 and the detonator and all that shit after. So hold your horses, okay? I might be back with a shotgun by then. You wanna meet my friend Shotgun? He's good. What's to say about the book? Piece of plastic shaped like a book. It looks like it was being held by a hand at some point. Okay. It might be useful for a puzzly. Uh, put you in there. Put some gunpowder in there. Yeah. Put the knife in there. Ah, uh, that seems good. That seems solid. I'm gonna do a little savey. That seems good. Okay. Let's go get to Claire. Wait, he said second floor east side? That's over here. Okay. Did I, get a, did I get a key for this? Thought this was a different key. Oh, it's just. Oh wait, yeah, this key. Ta-da! Okay, this is all new. I don't know what I'm doing now. They're probably fine. This, this stuff wasn't in the demo, so now I don't know what I'm doing. <gasps> oh, red book for the handman! Statue's left arm, hmm. I wonder what it goes in, though. Oh yeah, because I got the picture of that, that's what it's telling me. Can I...? Nope. You're not the Leon that I know. The Leon and Resi 4 would have definitely smashed that box. Yes! Oh, y'all gonna get it now! The ruby that captivated Edward the Black Prince. The pearl that the Queen of the Nile milked dry. That is weirdly sexual. The diamond that led a queen to the guillotine. Or guillotine, as the French would pronounce it. There is no end to the number of tales related to the appeal of jewels. This mysterious red stone is simply the latest to sparkle among them. Like, there's a blab of blab of fucking fancy artistic bastards. This is what I say to your art. Ha! Ha! Taste knife! From the real proud dad. Um, right, I am going straight back. 
Because I want to get that... I really want to get that shotgun, and I also want to get that book and bring it back here and see what... See what Statue Man has to offer. Real proud dad, real proud dad, coming down the steps. You think Leon Skennedy has his own theme song? I know I would. Um, was it this way? Yeah. <coughs> God, no loading times in any of these areas is so cool. Just one giant ass area. Wait, I couldn't go through here, could I? No. I need the... The clover key. Uh-oh. Oh wait, no, I didn't board that. I boarded you! Still just standing there. Yeah, good luck, buddy! Bingo is next week, I told you. This fucking guy. I feel like there was a much faster way back through here. Yeah, I didn't check down here the first time. And with right reason, because there's fuck up. Ooh, I could really go for a Sprite Cranberry right now. Good, you guys are still dead. Right where I left you. Boom, boom, baby! Ho <laughs> Gimme them toes! Gimme them steel boys! Fuck yes! Oh! Not feeling too good, it seems! Showed his ass. I know there was a shotgun bullet somewhere that I couldn't pick up. But I don't really care right now. Hi, Marvin. Yes, it's me. I'm back. I want I came back to get my red book. Have you seen it? Is there anything better than pussy? Yes, a really red book. Takeout. I'd love some takeout right now. Big sloppy burger, like the one the guy was eating at the start. Get it all up in my beard hairs. Ooh, that sounds good. Alright, real proud dad. Man, you have a great ass. I... I don't know why it took me this long to realize that, Leon. I'm sorry. I feel like I should have seen that glorious bootay earlier. Can you just put the fucking book in? Is he getting ready to whip a nene? Hmm. Scepter? What would I use this for? You can discard items that have served their purpose or any other key items with a tick mark by selecting the discard command. Oh! So keys that have served their purpose, like it's just done now, I don't need to use it for anything else ever again. A short staff with a jewel in it. Very fucking helpful. I know I can- I know it just said that I can toss the key, but I still don't trust it. Well, it wouldn't tell me that I couldn't discard it otherwise, would it? You're making me fucking scared. Oh, I can combine them. Sweet. Um, I can just put it in my box otherwise, but... Probably I should just discard it. I'll discard it if I come across anything else. Ah, uh, guys? Yeah, you okay? They are all kinds of dead. Bitch! What? Claire! Clary! Hold on, I'll be right there. Okay. Oh no. Oh no. Oh lordy. Claire. It's so nice to see you. How you doing? <laughs> that helicopter just came out yeah. of nowhere. I'm in one piece. 
I'm guessing you don't have a key in one of those fancy pockets? Uh, unfortunately, no. Mm. But how are you doing? <laughs> you know, just surviving. Yeah, you know. That's good. Yeah. Any luck with your brother? No, not yet. Claire, don't lose hope. I'm sure we're gonna find him. Damn. Unless he was in there. You know what that means? Yeah. Dinner time. <laughs> Claire, I think you should go. Don't worry about me, Leon. You take care of yourself. Claire, you need to go now. Was that Hideo Kojima? Okay. Let's get through this. Both of us. If we get through this, I'll treat you to a steak dinner. Marvin, I've got a situation here. I'm surrounded by zombies. Ah, don't use that word! Uh, okay. I'm gonna discard this bitch. Marvin, do you copy? Marvin! God damn it, Marvin, what are you doing? Dying? Damn it. Okay. I can hold a big old pile of those bad boys. Alright, now I got bolt cutters. Oh, shut up. How many, how many, how many bullets are left over in this? Eight? I could use eight bullets to kill you. Nah. It's still kind of just a waste, isn't it? Alright, bolt cutters! Now I can go to all sorts of places! Like this one. Hey, I'm back where I started! Can you... Could you guys not? I'm gonna close off this fucking doorway. You guys suck. Stay down. Stay down. Okay, I'm just wasting bullets at this point. Or am I? Ha ha! Um. All right, there was a door here, and there's one. Where was the other one? My brain can't think right now. There was another one somewhere upstairs. A greeny boy. Nope, 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 nope. No, you don't. A flash grenade. Okay, not yet. I have a bunch of shit that I need to get rid of. I'll come back for you later. Gunpowder. Jesus Christ, there's too many things. I want to test out this bad boy. Oh, ho, ho. yay! Get off me. Okay. Ah, shortcut. Ooh, electrical part. It's a fuse. Shit. I have too many things. And a valve. Oh, I'm finding all the items right now. High grade gunpowder, yellow. I need to fucking. Japers. What? Ah! Fuck! Suck on this! Oh yeah, baby! You tithead! Who's down there? I have a gun. <coughs> Okay, I have a lot of things that I can pick up and use in here. Oh, hey! Oh! Oh, I took a big lump of his shoulder off! Gross! But also fucking awesome! I should be using these bullets and then I can get rid of some of them. Hmm. I'm very reluctant to get rid of things. Hmm. 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 Okay, I'm just gonna store out stuff in my box out here. I can't fucking go that way. God dang it. Why does the stuff that I put down have to disappear? Okay, I'm gonna get rid of my knife for now, because I don't really care. The knife breaks very quickly, so I don't see I'd have much use for it anyway. Oh! Well, now I can go through. Ah! Ah! Fuck! If 
only I had my knife! Son of a bitch! I have made a disastrous error! Fucking hell, that's not even a face anymore! It doesn't even have the identifying features like skin! And a nose! Oh god, stop it, you sons of fucking bastards! Okay, I'm leaving. Leaving, S. Kennedy! Marvin? Marvin, are you dead? Put you in there. And I'm gonna put... You in there. Yeah. God, I have a lot of mixed herbs. Can't mix you- I can't remember the fucking mixings. Combine with that and make a super drug. No, I need yellows and blues and stuff. Alright, now let's save. Marvin! Still alive. Okay, good. Okay. This really proud dad can be proud. One day longer. Okay, Marvin and everybody at home, I'm gonna leave this first episode of Really Proud Dad Simulator here. This game is fucking awesome and I cannot wait to play more of it. I'm gonna be just so immersed in this for the next like week. I can't wait. And then you have so many other versions of it that you can play, like the Claire section and then you can come back with different outfits and cheats and ammos and oh, it's gonna be so good. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching this first episode. If you liked it, punch the like button in the face! Like a boss! And I play his own road. Whoosh! Whoosh! Well, thank you guys, and I will see all you dudes! Watch me eye! Marvin, don't disappoint this really proud dad.